So are you like me and you have this problem where these press fit bushings are not press fit? I don't know if my reamer was a little off off 90 or what, but I <clears throat> over reamed these apparently. Or I got the wrong size reamer and they're just they're just a perfect fit for the bushing. So here's a quick tip on how to fix that without ordering a new bracket. First of all, you will need two of these one inch chrome steel ball bearings. Uh, I got these off of Amazon for a couple bucks. Next, you'll need a vise. Um, and you're essentially going to take the bushing and you're going to put it between the two bearings. And I'm to, to keep the ball from popping, you know, left, right, up, or down when you apply pressure, I am inserting it inside of the little screw divots there um, on either side. So let me get that set up and I'll show All you right. what that is. Here we are, we've got it in the vise. And I've got it taut. It's not overly tight, but it's also not super loose. From here, this is where we're going to actually, we're going to have to squeeze it enough to deform the brass. Now, your vise may vary. This is a cheapo, and it's got a bit of flex in it once, once I actually start to squeeze, especially since it's off-center here. Um, but for my vise, it's about, I don't know, between 45 and 90 degrees before I start to see, um, you know, a good, a good deformation in the right direction. You can kind of look at the sheen on top of the brass and it gives you a good idea of uh, whether or not it's deformed or not. So that's about 90 and I hope I didn't go too much there, but that's about 90. Uh, I'm going to give that a go and we'll see how it fits. 90 on this Vice wasn't quite enough, so I'm going to give it a little bit more. Okay, here we are. This I ended up having to turn it on the vice about I don't know, 150 to 180 degrees um, before it would actually deform enough. So this, the tip of it just barely fits in there to kind of hold itself, but there's no way in a million years I'm pushing that in by hand. So now I'm going to go grab a C-clamp and uh, press fit it just like you would normally. Just in case anyone was curious, I just wanted to show you how I am press fitting mine. Um, since the bushings are a little bit wider than the bracket itself, I put in a little large washer um, in there so that as I'm pressing it, it can extend past the brackets ever so slightly. Um, so let me finish this up and I'll show you when I'm done. All right, here we are, all finished. You can see it kind of sticks out a 64th, 32nd, something like that. Um, but the number four, A and four goes right in. Uh, and we're good to go. So, focus. Uh, anyway, happy building, happy new year.